So we're down here at Prison today with Adrian Quave Hobbs. So Adrian, what are we doing today? Today we're just going to give you a taste of, it of what the sim's like. Um, we've got the Autumn Park because it's your first race, so we can learn a few more details about the track and maybe find some key points to give you a few attempts when you actually get there for your first race. And it's going to be on a GT3 car today as well, front engine. So it's rear wheel drive, a little bit different, but it's what we've got on the system and I think it'll be a good introduction to what we do and where we can move forward really. Awesome, let's check it out. First Adrian showed me a replay of him driving the same car on the track. Adrian not only runs ProSim and coaches there, he is a very experienced racing driver himself. I couldn't wait to have a go, the simulator looked amazing. As you get in you notice the 180 degree wraparound screen. Apparently it's the only true 180 degree display in the UK that doesn't stretch the image. Once you are in the seat you really can't see anything else, it's completely immersive. Adrian took me through the controls on the wheel. Then it was time for me to go out on track. I took it slow at first to learn the car and the track. The car felt so powerful and with it being rear wheel drive I had to adapt my driving style because my team hard VW Golf is front wheel drive. In a way it felt more familiar because the kart has rear wheel drive too. I took it lap by lap. I could feel myself getting quicker and quicker. First experience was just completely insane. The feeling in the steering wheel was just unreal and the pedals and everything. It was like really adrenaline feeling but as I was building up through the session and then I started to go a bit faster at the end and it was just absolutely insane at the end how fast these are. The wraparound screen is a lot different to the triple screen setup and it makes you feel a lot more involved in what's going on and a lot more immersed in the experience and it's just it's, makes it feel makes takes your mind away from it being like a simulator and makes it actually feel as if you're on track there and then. After my first session, Adrian took me through the data and showed me where I was braking too early and where I could carry more speed. He had a lot of insights into what I was doing that I just didn't see until he pointed it out. After a few more sessions, I could really feel the difference and the improvements we found. In every session, the lap times just kept tumbling. The day overall has been an absolutely amazing learning experience. I've definitely learned so much about Winton Park. I feel like I could go there right now and be confident driving around and today um, at ProSim has been absolutely awesome in the simulators and on the track and it's just got me buzzing to actually get out of there for the first time in the car. Today's with Adrian's help on the data from my sessions has been really good. Being able to look at my braking points my speed and my acceleration and my gears compared to Adrian's lap has been really helpful in identifying the exact places where I need to go faster and throughout the day it's just made me improve every lap and I just can't thank him enough for today. We've just finished a really productive day here at Prison. just finished going through the data with Adrian. So how did I do today? You're only just over a second off which I think for your first time in a car that you've never dri driven or probably even seen much about is really good. The progression, which to be honest is the main thing for a driver at your stage of development, was really exceptional. You started slow, which was good, just learning your way around and feeling yourself into it without making too many mistakes. And then every session you built and improved. And in the end, that's an extremely good lap time, I think, for your first time. Cool, right. Thanks a lot, Adrian.